we've got three undergraduate courses in creative writing. One, single honours creative writing. The other is English literature and creative writing. And the last one is English language and creative writing. Creative writing is actually quite a new subject for the University of Brighton. It's, it's kind of developed over the years in line with student demand. It started as one kind of single module, two hours a week here at Brighton. Uh, and slowly it's kind of snowballed into, into a really thriving area. Here at Brighton, we take a really practice-based approach. So you'll be encouraged to write in a whole range of genres and styles. So if, you've, if you're if you coming to university thinking, oh, I really love um, short stories, or I'm really into performance poetry, or I really love scripts and, 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 and you know, watching a box set on Netflix and that's the kind of thing that I like to write, then when we really feel that we're kind of set up uh, and ready for you because we want to encourage you to follow your passions, but we also want to test you in other styles and genres as well. So it might be um, looking at a graphic novel, for example. Uh, we're also going to get you to make a short autobiographical film while you're here too. And really think about what makes for great storytelling. English language, for example, is sort of the bones of um, English. So you really need that structure in place um, but creative writing is sort of the blood and the guts that goes into that and on top of that to, to kind of uh, to make a kind of more 3D human shape if you like um, and literature I guess is the study of writing um, and ideas about writing and creative writing is the practice of that as well and I really believe that creative writing and storytelling is at the very heart of what it is to be human we tell stories all the time. You know, we tell stories to, to, to understand history, for example, or if we're trying to explain something to someone, we'll, we'll tell them a story. If we're trying to kind of give an insight into ourselves or a memory from a recent holiday or uh, a relationship that we've had, then we usually, you do it telling a story.